Yeah, I think Hannah's tremendous, and I think it's just the confidence and belief. You know, I think she, tonight she played with an energy about herself of, you know, she really could go in there and dominate, and, you know, she goes toe-to-toe -to -toe with Aaliyah Edwards, who in my mind is one of the best players in the country, um, you know, was physical with her, guarded her well, boxed her out, um, and, you know, she wasn't afraid to take it at her either. I thought um, when they subbed in some post players off the bench, Hannah continued to go at them. Um, and, I, you know, I'm just super happy for Hannah. She's worked so hard um, to be in this moment. She goes five for seven from the free throw line, makes some big free throws for us. Um, but, yeah, she was definitely a difference maker. So uh, I think this is the Hannah we all know, um, you know, just having that confidence within herself because we all have it in her. So just would be super happy for her. So, like, UConn's a really good defensive team. They're one of the best defensive teams we've seen all year. I think Nika did a tremendous job, got, job guarding me. Um, uh, we got some, some good looks. They just didn't go in. Um, and sometimes that's just what happens. We miss some, some easy bunnies around the rim. Um, but I think the, the best thing about our group is, you know, we went to the locker room at halftime and, you know, it wasn't like, oh, come on, you got to make shots. It was, no, stop turning the ball over and you're going to be perfectly fine. We knew at some point our shots was, were going to go down. And, you know, we put up 45 points in the second half, um, 25 in the third quarter, um, came out in the fourth quarter and started really hot. So I don't think it was a, you know, a, like a freaking out of our offense not working. I think it was just a, you know, it'll come around. You know, we didn't execute great, and we were only down six. We felt really confident in that, and nobody panicked. Everybody knew just need to clean it up a little bit, and that's exactly what we did. I think I was, what, 0 for 6, and then finished 3 for 5 from the three-point line in the second half. That's, you know, not too bad. And, um, you know, I think the biggest thing is, you know, don't fall in love with your three-point shot. Get into the paint. Get in the paint. Um, get some easy baskets, um, you know, then that's kind of what I did. I would have liked to get my feet in the paint a little bit more in the second half. But, um, you know, they played really good defense on me, honestly. Like, when I started driving, they threw two people at me. They were going to make me give up the ball. And um, I think that's one of the greatest ways our program has evolved over the course of, you know, me being here. I used to feel like I had to do everything. And now, you know, I have so much trust in my teammates, and my teammates have so much trust in me. And I just knew they were going to make plays down the stretch. Kate was huge down the stretch, made some big plays for us. And... Um, you know, that's the reason we won the game. It wasn't, it wasn't just Caitlin. It wasn't just Hannah. It was all five players on the court came up and made big plays at, you know, really crucial times. So we had four turnovers in the second half, and two of our turnovers come late in the fourth quarter. So, um, you know, those are situations we get put in all the time in practice. So you would like to execute them better. But I think our, our group is so mature and so experienced that, like, you don't have time to worry about that. Like, it happened, it's over, you better focus and move on to the next play. And like Hannah said, like, Gabby Marshall just comes up with big defensive plays all the time. Like, you see it time and time again for us. Um, and she doesn't get enough credit for what, what she does. She guards one of the best players in the country and really, you know, challenges, challenges her quite a bit. You know, Paige had a great game. I thought Gabby just played great defense on her, even when Paige made some tough baskets. Gabby just responded and kept going up there and guarding her. So um, I'm really proud of her. And, um, you know, I'm proud of our group for, you know, just being able to flip the page and move on to the next play. Yeah, I think it was 39 seconds was the game clock, 30 on the shot clock. Um, so a nine second differential and you know, I let it go down and I think I started to drive right um, At about nine seconds and Aaliyah Edwards was guarding her and she was popping straight up to the top of the key And Aaliyah Edwards completely left her to come double or show on me So the read is to give the ball up um, and, You know Hannah made a great play the other girl, two girls helped in they got a deflection on the ball and just were able to get the ball and call timeout um, but, you know, that's the read. I'm giving the ball up 10 times out of 10. There's two people on me. I trust my teammates to, to make a play. And, you know, U UConn just played great defense. Um, but I think the biggest thing is, like, after that turnover, we just went back right to the huddle, and Gabby came up with a huge defensive stop for us.